We're gonna make a door in a day. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, it's pretty cool. Yeah. Today we are going to start working on the sliding door for the bathroom. Let's go! It's like an inch practically dead nut. Perfect. Cool. Okay, so we'll go for an inch on all of them. Nice! Man, you would never know that these boards used to be pallets. Like, they're, well, except for the holes, obviously, but like, there's some nice looking wood under there. So. First thing we're going to do is, so I've got that line set up there to be the bottom edge. Mm -hmm. So first we'll get this part. Before you uh, get too crazy with that, uh, we need to get this piece squared up. Okay. And then we'll, uh, we'll center that piece and get that one squared up. Do we need to be sanding these or anything first or sand it after the whole shebang? Probably just sand it afterwards. Okay. And we'll need this one soon. Not yet, though. Is this thing recording? Yeah, yeah, this is how I get all the money. Get the good stuff. This is how I get the good action. We're trying to figure out our ass from the hole in the ground. Right? We've got our ass in a hole in the ground. <laughs> Okie dokie. Just like that, we're going to have a door built. Hey. Okay. What was that? We'll have the door done by this afternoon. Hopefully. Can you imagine if we did a project in a day? That would be a first. Here, like this. You're gonna love how I eyeballed it. I know it. I knew it! I knew you, it! You dead nutted it! Dead! Yeah. Eyeball and hands. I have fingers. I felt the edge. Move, move your fingers. Here you, go. you can't doubt how you feel. How, do you do you doubt how you feel? I don't doubt how I, I don't doubt my feelings. <laughs> so you're gonna put more shell. Oh, that was a little crooked. Doesn't matter. <laughs> Just checking. <laughs> and he went with how he felt, and that's all that matters. I went with my feelings. Thirty-five and a pube hair. Was it thirty-five and a half? Thirty. Five and a quarter? Thirty-five and a quarter. Thirty-five and a quarter. It was seventy and a half, so thirty-five and a quarter. Okay. Yeah. There's the the pubert that we'll remove. See you later, pubert. We're gonna make a door in a day. Hey, 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 hey. Good today, huh? Oh, Smudgy nose. Oh. <laughs> yeah, good boy.
That's pretty cool. Yeah. Brian put a piece of angle iron on the outside edge of the door so we get the whole thing straight. Good idea, Braun. Thanks, Aaron. That's because we don't have one continuous piece of uh, lumber long enough to span it. Ideally, if we had at least two pieces, like the far left, far right, um, then that could help keep the door square. But since we've got a seam in the middle, we're hoping that this will be strong enough to be just a, a hanging door that's not hinged or anything. It's just hanging, that's all it's doing. So yeah. if it's a little weak in the middle, like, Who cares? I think it'll be fine. Yeah. And we're working with a janky table that's really served us. It has, it has. With all reclaimed materials, even reclaimed screws to put that together. To take the circular saw and just rip off these little nubbins to make it straight. Ish. Straight. Right, everyone? Straight ish. Well done. Saw guide. It's hardly anything, but this is what we're working with here. On there so that I cut it straight because I'm not freehanding this. So I put the guide up to the edge, and then it should be all right. All right, ready? Here's the door we've been using. This is a traveling yoga mat. It's quite nice. Right fit it Rooney. We're not actually gonna put it on the track. Just going to put it in the space. Ooh, cute. I'm gonna have to take down your temporary mirror for a second. All right. 
Yeah. That works, right? Ha ha. That is great. Cool. It should keep the turd smell in the bathroom, right? I wonder if that fly is swarming me because he wants to be YouTube famous. Probably. <laughs> Y'all, we just woke up. It's in the eight o'clock hour and we literally have like eight days left for this build to finish it. Whew, getting tired, not gonna lie. We've been working hard, time for some coffee. Morning. Real nice. So that's right, I put a little syrup in there. Canadian maple syrup. It's delicious. It's really, really good. And 3% milk really kicks it up a notch. So that's basically how my morning starts. I get up, brush my teeth, have a nice whiz, take a dump sometimes make coffee. Let's see what it earns up to. <laughs> what a story. I'm putting the uh, first coat of Verithane on this side of the door. Last night I got the other side of the door totally all three coats complete. So um, within a couple I don't know, maybe an hour or two, we'll be able to hang the bathroom door. That looks really good. It makes that top board pop like crazy. Oh yeah, major pop. All of them. Major pop. It doesn't stay so yellow like it it kind of pulls like a warm color when it's wet, but then when it dries, it almost like neutralizes it and like adds like a purpley, pearly tone to it. So it like cancels out the yellow tones. Mm. It's just color theory. Wow, look at it change right before your eyes. <laughs> like to really gob it in the cracks. Makes sense. It'll run, so you gotta keep an eye on it.
Hey, after we get this door done and hung, what do you want to work on today? Uh, I think we need to continue moving forward and uh, see what's on the list. But we yeah. were talking about just starting in the back and then just looking at every single area as we're going and saying what's done here, what's mm -hmm. not done here, what do we need to finish. What's pressing. What's pressing. And what's not. Because like, like if we keep moving forward, we could really nitpick all the little details, but we also have to remember that there's stuff that, like we can't drive the bus without stuff put in its place. Like yeah. if you imagine taking where you live right now, throwing wheels on it and saying, okay, we're gonna drive in half an hour. <laughs> Good luck. Yeah. Like the amount of stuff that people put on services once they start to get comfortable is on real even yeah. if you're a tidy person good luck trying to drive right now yeah so we need to make sure that our stuff can be secured and like in place before we move the yeah. vehicle luckily we got the whole underbody completely secured and yeah. uh got the fuel cabinet done uh so that's really really good that that's done because then yeah. we can throw our tools and um whatever else that can't fit up here down below yeah. um we we should probably visit the list that we have and see what's left on that um, it's yeah <laughs> and then we can get back into like the fun stuff yeah because <laughs> a lot of things on the list aren't very fun all right, while well you continue this, I'm gonna take them to the list and right. see what we have left. All right, I'll meet you up there. All right, cool. <laughs> All right, y'all, here is the official we need to get done list. Um, all the ones with the check marks we're finishing. So the power steering reservoir is just kind of loose. We need to just uh, secure that with a, a hose clamp or something. Um, windshield wipers, they work but one of the little hoses uh, broke off and so we need a new hose we don't have that yet frame the door so this is cockpit area all the highlight ones are what we're looking at right now um, we really need to frame that front door uh, driver side couch this is like a little cushion thingamajig that um, like platform that we're gonna have on the driver's side above the wheel well Couches, they're already pretty built. There's still a little bit left that needs to be done, like cladding it with some uh, plywood. Um, coffee table, we need to route out the guts of this massive piece of black walnut. Just the same stuff as these counters here. Um, let's see, drawer beside toaster. Oh, I didn't show you this last night, y'all. It was late but I made some brackets that screw onto the bottom of the toaster oven. There's the feet here, and all I did was unscrew the feet, and then I put a little bracket uh, that is made with uh, stainless steel um, sheet metal from the wood-burning stove edge. So um, the heat shield here that we had edited, I went ahead and took the drop of stainless steel from that and I fabbed uh, three brackets uh, for three of the legs. So this thing is solid. It doesn't move around anymore. So we can drive and it'll stay there. So sorry I didn't get any film of that. It was late. I just needed to get it done. Um, but here's the drawer that we're going to have right here. It's going to have like a little low wall and probably like a half drawer sort of thing open on the top. Uh, let's see what else we got on the list. Um, bolt toaster. I did that. Uh, pantry shelf rails. Um, what is pantry shelf rails? Oh, that's... um. I want to make like rope type things to hold the stuff. Oh, uh, with those in anchors? Place. Yeah. Yeah, we'll probably anchor it to the back and then have something that holds yeah. stuff in place. I don't know. We got to figure well, out we what to do with do all these that jars. Before we go, we might just throw these in like totes a, or a tote. something. And That'd be good because like when we stop, all this glass needs to be able to be secure because mm -hmm. we don't want flying mason jars. Yeah. Well, this probably isn't going to be the permanent place for these. This is oh, just yeah. like where they've ended up right now right now because this is the place that we had to put them yeah oh man what else is on the list this is um that's it 
that's all the pressing stuff. So we're gonna try to knock all of these highlighted ones out this week. Um, I'd also like to get the frame around this door mm -hmm. done because uh, I want to also, while we're on the road, build this uh, this uh, bug screen, bug screen <laughs> to have a slit in the middle and then magnets that hold it together. Kind of like the ones you buy, but we've got one for the front door, but it'd be nice to have one for right here too. And we have magnets, so we're able to do that. So y'all, it's time to just hang out, drink a little coffee, get ready for the day, and uh, and then work on a lot of random projects. Just looking to see how high to start these bolts. So I am putting this here and spinning the bolt. Because there's two nuts, one that goes on top of this bracket and one that goes below. exceptional. Just snug. It doesn't need to be key womaned. So we'll still be a little crack. So I guess if we have guests over, we'll just try not to be in the back while people are using the washer. And there will be a little bit of wall here also. That's still pretty good. Keeping Tom back. Yeah. of privacy you're gonna be a creeper maybe a creeper don't be a creeper I'm peeping Tom or Tomala Tomala 